I'm going to count this as a journal entry today, but in reality, it's really not a journal entry. I just wanted to kind of put the things that are going to happen this year back into the air, kind of like my 10 year plan did, but kind of do it in a different sense and just speak on it. This year is this year is going to be the most amazing, if not the best year of my life. I know that the work I'm putting in, the time I'm putting in, the effort I'm putting in, the videos I'm making, the progress I'm making, all the shit I'm doing this year is going to be absolutely worth it and it's time and this whole year is going to be just constant 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 and i mean constant grinding constant putting shit in constant fucking putting the work in constant just actually putting in the output people the way i'm going this year is ten thousand shots ten thousand shots reload reload ten thousand shots and the thing is, I'd rather I'd rather shoot at the game and miss all of my shots than make them all in practice and then mean nothing. Yeah, I made the shots in practice, but what are they going to do for me at the end in the long run? I'd rather make the mistakes of just going through it while y'all watch and y'all see me put it in the work than me doing it behind the scenes, making all the shots. And then when I come do it, I fail it anyway. And then I have to go learn the same lesson that I taught myself in practice. It makes no sense. I would rather... I'm not even rather, I'm going to put in the shots. And if I miss, I miss. But I know the other 9,999 are going to go in. And if those don't go in, maybe the other 9,998 are going to go in. So it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, as long as I'm putting in output, not just any kind of output, good fucking output. And that's all I've been doing this year. This whole year has just been good ass output. I can't name. I don't even think y'all can name. Y'all can't name anything that I haven't done this year in this 18 days that hasn't been good, whether it's been just me speaking and it's giving you insight and sparking something inside of you, or if it's just been me really, you know, going in on the visuals. Like, I think no matter what, this year has been perfect for me and it's going to keep being perfect. And I'm just, I'm excited to bring it in. How do I feel emotionally? I feel good. I feel great. I feel hopeful. I feel energetic. Not even hopeful. I feel destined. I feel nothing but triumph and I haven't even won yet. You know what I mean? Like it's big stuff on the way. And like, I see all of my homies. I, I love, and I mean, love seeing it. I love seeing Annabelle win. Annabelle Klein is fucking, she's like one of my inspirations for just hard work and shit, bro. She's absolutely amazing. I love seeing Annabelle fucking grind. Justice Xavier, he's always doing big shit. I see that so up close. Me and him are like this. Like, I absolutely, I just love seeing this shit happen, man. I love seeing my homies win, and I love seeing my homies grow, even if they don't consider me homies. Like, Annabelle, I don't know if you consider me a homie like that, but I, it doesn't matter. I'm proud of you, and I'm really happy to see you win. And, like, people like Dee Dee, Justice, fucking Sniper, Adil, fucking Overpaid, fucking Pertinent, fucking Perry Mason. There's so many good people in the underground right now. There's so much good shit in the underground right now. And people don't even realize how much good is in the underground. The stuff that's just coming up and coming out of the underground is beautiful. And whether we all make it at the same time, only a handful of, of us can make it. I know I'm going to be one of that handful. Fuck, fuck the handful. I'm number one. I'm the number one at the... I'm, I'm number one. And I, I'm just excited for y'all to see it as much as I am excited for me to see it. So I'm really excited for this shit, man. I'm really excited for this year. And to all the artists, to all the people who have a dream, to all the people who have something they want to do, just remember that no matter what you do, make sure you're doing what you love, what makes you happy, what's going to get you farther, what's going to help you grow, what's going to help you become a better person, and what's going to help you reach your dream. Because at the end of the day, yes, there's people you have to care for. There's people that you have to show respect for. And there's a lot of people you have to show respect to, and they deserve it. Know that. Know that the people that you need to show respect to deserve it. Even if they've done you, I don't know, but people deserve respect. And make sure you give it in the right amount that you need to. Control yourself. Control your anger. Control your emotions. Control how you feel. Control how you take things. Control your output. You can't control what's inputted, but you can control your output. Control your output and make sure it's the best output possible. We don't want one plus one to equal four. We want it to equal two. And you deserve it to equal two. So at the end of the day, chase your goals, chase your dreams. If you didn't know, and if you needed a sign, this is your sign. Go all in.
do what you need to do. Make it work. Make it beautiful. Make this year the best year of your life. Because me, that's what I'm doing, nigga. So I'm going to say all that at the end of the year. <laughs>